Alright, hello people of YouTube, I am SRMF, we're opening Zendikar, motherfucker, we're opening Zendikar with a razor blade, just to spice things up a bit, who knows, maybe next time I open a box I'll do it with a big ass knife, but until then, let's see what the fuck we got, alright. Ooh. Ooh! We got two! Uh, I got a comrade over here if he wants to open one of these with me. Oh, I'll open one. Alright. You go first. Alright, let's see what the one I get is. I will never forget that the audio recording on this is so fucking loud. And opening packs is just hell if you need a fucking camera. Alright. And we flop. Volknut, the Molten Pinnacle, enters tab. Whenever the mountain enters the battlefield, if you have at least five other mountains, it deals three damage to any target? Board white land, question mark? Oh my god. Well, this is going to my mono red. Commander deck, that's a fucking fact. Alright. Then we flip. Ooh, it's another land. Ooh. Spire Guardian. Uh, bring it up to the camera more. Uh, enters battlefield tapped unless you can have two or more opponents. Taps for red or green. Oh, oh, oh. Both of these That's are... That's a mythic land, too. All of these are mythic lands. All the box Ooh. toppers are. It's because they're so good. They're so busted. So OP, my dude. Alright. Now, for the collector. Alright, now to open it. Alright. I saw what the token was. And it's a token, which is good. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Saw what the first card was. It wasn't too good. Now we'll start with the first card, which is Scavenged Blade. Foil. Field Research. Pretty good. Condu Stomper. Ooh -hoo -hoo -hoo. And the Expedition Diver. I fucking love all these foils. I've. It's the one thing I will always. No, no, I don't want to see what that last card is. Don't fucking show me. Alright, Moss Pit Ooh, Skelly. Moss pit. Gonna have that, that. I do need to put one of those in the green black commander deck. Alright. Out. Someone that in the deck. I can feel this Voyager. I don't actually have a deck made just yet for these, but I'm gonna pretty soon. Oh my god! Charix. The Raging Isle. This thing is busted and fucking historic and, uh,. Vintage? Anything with high alert. It's busted, yeah, with those walled back high alert decks. Fucking, it's so good. But I then love you it. just returned in hatred. <laughs> this is the second one of these I have acquired. But the first one of them, that is this art. I love it. I love it all. I smacked the shit. I didn't mean to smack it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, dude. We got another fucking... Oh, it's in. We got another fucking box topper. Well, goddamn. And then an angel warrior. Which is also a plant. I actually needed more of these. Alright. Zane, your turn. Pick a box. Pick a box. I'm going to go for the second one. Alright. I'm going to open it away from the camera. Because it's loud as shit. Yeah. I'm going to put the razor blade away. So I don't accidentally fucking cut myself. Alright. I'm gonna go from the mountain this time. We're gonna look at the goblin construct. I hate this card. I love it. I hate it. Flip it. What else is it? Core Warrior. So we got a totem. And then we'll flip it over. I do not know how to pronounce these cards. Tazim Raptor. Uh, when no. Tazim Raptor enters the battlefield, you may return you control to its owner's hand. So it's landfall support, more or less. Yeah, I'm bad at this. <laughs> the Ardent Electromacer. Uh, when it enters the Ooh, battlefield. That's actually pretty good. If you have a party deck. A party. You just avoid the party. Yeah. Game it. it is hard to look at the camera. camera and the cards at the same time. These are nice foils, though. Ooh. Ooh. Marauding Blight Priest. This thing is actually very good in a lifelink cleric deck. The better vampire, uh, I forget. Epicure of Blood. Yeah, Epicure of Blood. 
It's a way better one. Broken Wings, this card is actually very good for dealing with not only flying decks, but also colorless decks. Yeah, this is actually a very good card. Oh, I yeah. definitely needed that buff. Merc's Enchantments. And then Nahiri's Binding, a fucking oh, pacifism yeah. that can also go to Planeswalkers. Which is pretty fucking good, actually. Uh, Short-footed Infiltrator. Uh, tap and untap Grove. He can't be blocked. Whenever he deals damage, draw a card. I think that's actually the first one of those I have. Mm, spoils of Adventure. Oh my god, dude, this... Oh, go, go back to, like, their gold. Like, their, oh my god. Dude, they look so good with yeah, the fucking this card light. Looks very good. Ah, dude. Adventure decks. I'm not Adventure decks. The party decks are gonna be very mm -hmm. good when the fucking D and D. Ooh, coveted Ooh. prize. Cost one less for each creature in your party. Search your card. Search your library for a card. Put it in your hand. Shuffle your library. If you have a full party, you may cast a spell with converted mana cost four or less without paying its mana cost. Hmm. Ooh, rolling vortex. At the beginning of each player's upkeep, rolling vortex deals one damage to them. Alrighty, sorry about that little mishap right there. Uh, my buddy had to leave, sadly. But, we're gonna finish opening the Zendikar real quick. So, Rolling Vortex. Oh yeah, fucking shuts down Lifelink, as he was telling me. Never play a cast no spell if no mana was spent. To cast that spell, it deals 5 damage. Ooh hoo hoo. It's not bad. Prowling Fedeline. Fedelier. Territorial Skikia. Nissa, fuck, yes. This is actually the second one of these I have. This art specifically, too. Ooh, hoo, hoo. the bushfire. Waste, ooh, -hoo. sacrifice, destroy target, non basic land. Nice, 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 as many would say. Gotta organize my piles correctly. Alright. Oh, yeah, that's it. That one's gone. Next pack. I open it off the camera. Core Celebrant. Whenever it or another creature enters the battlefield, you gain one life. Subtle Strike. This card is actually pretty fucking good. In a 1 1 Gogori deck. Highborn Vampire. This. It's okay. Shiny. Dauntless Unity. Ooh. Uh. Oh yeah. Uh, Praxian Tactics. Just a base. Bad one. Solidarity of Strength. This is actually very good for a party gimmick fucking deck. Uh. Relic Amulet. Oh yeah. Wizard. Wizard's gonna be the fucking blue. Blue red of it. It's gonna be the is it. Wizard is it. This is gonna be a part of it. Mm, Fireblade Charger. As long as it's equipped, it has haste. Whenever it dies, it deals damage equal to its power to any target. It's actually very good. An equip deck. Focus! Uh, come on. Boop. Focus. Is that too close? That was too close. Okay. Hell yeah. Looks so good. Inscription of Abundance. Kick it. Make it five. Uh, choose all of them. You have no reason not to choose all of them. Ho 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 ho, second one of these. Foil one. Uh, it's actually the first foil one I've gotten. But very good. I will take and keep forever. Kanzuri Nectar Pot. Very good in landfall. Ooh, this is actually the first one of these arts I've gotten. Nice. Oh shit, we got a fucking Jace. Ugh. Disgust. Absolutely disgusting. Kick him, make him five. Fucking, you get a copy who isn't a legendary. Scry, zero. Disgust. Get out of my face. Spitfire. <sighs> Swarm Shambler. It's a fungi beast. Whenever he enters the battlefield, he puts. Enters the battlefield with a 1 1 counter. Whenever a creature you control with a 1 1 counter on it becomes a target of a spell and an opponent controls, target cre create a 1 1 insect creature token. Put a 1 1 counter on Scorm Sandler. 
It's not too bad. And then we got a Core Warrior with the Goblin Construct. Hell yeah. Get, getting those thrown your way fucking when you got Forsaken Monument actually isn't that bad. Because then your opponent's just giving you two threes for free. Yeah, they deal one damage, but every time you cast a colorless spell, you're gaining two health. I see no downside. Alright, first card. Cancer. Second card. Drawn a silencer. Uh, enters the battlefield. Target creature and opponent controls gets XX minus X minus X by X's creatures and party. Vanquish weak. Yes, vanquish all of the lock. Seagate Colossus. Golem warrior. When you are battered and exhausted, look up and be inspired by its resolve. Well, yeah, it doesn't have lungs. Of course it's going to fight forever. You bastard. Ooh, the Crocodile from the first one of these we did. Demon's Disciple. Oh, this is just a new fucking, uh... The Plague Motherfucker. From 21, I believe. No, not 21. Uh, M20. I hated him. Whenever he enters the battlefield, each opponent sacrifices a creature or a planeswalker. Shuji Celta. No. Uh, type of creature you control against protection from color of your choice until end turn. Then we got a mountain. Ooh, Hagra's Mauling. Uh, cost one less for if your opponent controls no basic lands. Destroy target creature. And then it just tapped for a black mana. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Orin Reef Ooze Foil Boy. <laughs> Fucking enters battlefield, put a 1 1 counter on target creature you control whenever it attacks. Put a 1 1 counter on each creature that attacking with a 1 1 counter on it. Very good in an aggro deck. Manaki Ox. Not good at all. Ruin Crab, I hate this. Get it out of my goddamn face. Ooh hoo 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 hoo. This is pretty damn amazing, if I do say so myself. Looks. Straight beautiful. And then we got the Dread Worm. Gains indestructible whenever it land enters the battlefield under your control. Shadow's Verdict. Exile all creatures and planeswalkers with converted mana cost three or less from the battlefield, and all creatures and converted mana cost for three or less from all graveyards. It's just a fuck you. That, that's all that is. Oh, my little kitty. A little kitty cat. What an insect. Both shiny. Ah. Next pack. We open. Come on. Here we go. And flop. Mesa Lynx. As long as it's not your turn, gets plus two health. Tether Peak Ambusher. And the fucking gets plus two if you pay th three. Mighty Marissa. It's actually not bad if you kick it and then copy it. Nissa Zendikar. 4-4, four, four, Reach and Haste. It's, oh, this actually works with Nissa. Shit. I'm stupid. I, I gotta work. I'll throw those in a deck now. Uh, whenever it attacks, it gains plus one for each creature in your party. And he has Trample. Why isn't he just punching this thing in the face? He's just breaking its leg. Uh, Thundering Spike Mage. Whenever it enters the battlefield, deals X damage to creature or planeswalker where X is creatures and piety. Nice. Kite Sail Cleric. Uh, kick him. You get to tap two creatures. It's just a worse fucking art. Actually, no, it's. No, yeah, it's a worse one. Mm. I don't know. I'm torn to see if it's. say if it's better or worse. Hoo Swamp Sexy. Now here he's also forming. The sacrifice X lands for each land sack. This way, draw a card. You may play additional X lands this turn. Lands you control into the battlefield. Tap this turn. Okay, that's going to my mono red commander. <gasps> Jesus Christ! Leyline tyrant foil, my boys. This is just green mono. It's just mono red fucking arm math. The fucking. It's so fucked. He keeps red. That's all. That's, he keeps red mana. It never goes away. You may pay any amount when he dies. And it deals damage to any target. It's so good. I love him. 
sky cliffs you red you suck you are beautiful because you are elemental i love you you're there i guess just a thing who who's land i don't know i i have no <laughs> i don't really use that card wow another one of these insects Ooh, i actually do need one need more of these i got deck idea for them i'm going to make it good and we got a drake and a plant nice Hold on, I gotta, gotta fix my tile real quick. Eh, eh, eh. Hold on, it's almost done, almost done. There we go, there we go. There we go, all done now. Alright, next pack. Are we already, ah, oh, fuck it. Let's just dump out the whole damn thing. See how many packs we got left. You, my friend, are getting added to the collection of collector boxes my brother has bought me. Oh, yes. Before I forget, thank you, Jared, for buying me these fucking cards to open for your amusement. Close, you stupid box. Come on. Come on. All right. Good enough. Get up there. Get up there. Get the fuck. All right. Good enough. All right. Uh, let's see. We got seven? That's what it's looking like. Yep, seven, including the one in my hand. All right, we open. We throw. And we flip. Molten Blast. Page three, choose one. Deals two damage to target creature, planeswalker, or destroy an artifact. That's not too bad. Incognition, get out of my face. Uh, Territorial Skycat. This card's actually awesome. I love it. It's got scythe for arms. Canopy Biolith. Uh, I guess plus two, plus two, four. Yeah, it's not bad. Not good. This thing's really fucking good. I love it. I'm going to try and make a deck around it. I'm going to figure something out for it. Journey to Oblivion costs one less. Enters the battlefield. Exile target non-land permanent opponent controls. Until Journey leaves the battlefield. Nice. Actually, it's pretty good. I never fully read the damn thing. Ooh, Ballad Again Recovery. Uh, return target card from your graveyard to your hand. And just tapped. And we got a land. Ooh, 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 I saw another Nissa. Yash. Yashon. Implaceable Earth. I have five of these now. Nissa of Shadowed Bogs. Whenever it land enters, we've already seen this. Ah, shit. Oh, we saw land. <laughs> Ooh, into his battlefield gets. Oh, this is a boy. He's a good boy. Dreadworm. Be gone now. Ho 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 I got a deck for you. Jared, are you excited? Your deck, it grows powerful. Canopy Chernobyl. Mm, beautiful, I love him. I, no, be gone. Get out of my face. I don't want to see you. No. You will not be seen. Your converted mana cost will never be seen. Oh, we got a kitty. And a plant. Alright, he will stay hidden. Until my next pack open. I will do it. I don't want to see that son of a bitch. He can go burn. I'm so glad Nahiri fucking kills him. Ah, <laughs> uh, dude. Not gonna lie, do the same. <laughs> All right, resolute strike, sneaking get ah guide. Imagine having a goblin be the one to save your life. Wouldn't that just suck? Venture awaits. No, it doesn't. Only death. Prowling fetter. Gotta think of something for you, dreadworm. I think the original art for dreadworm looks way better than its fucking alternate one. I don't care for you. I hate you. I, I, I just hate kind of almost any counter spell. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, gain control target artifact with a mana cost X or less. This artifact is an equipment. Attach it to this. Oh god, I got a burp. 
and you make number three, and you're four, yo. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, okay, yeah. Definitely gotta make a... Probably a green-white fucking landfall deck. It's gonna be fun. You're not a rare, you're an uncommon. You look beautiful. Dreadworm. Ooh, branch loft. Boulder Paw. God damn it, that's the token pile. I fucked up. Ruin Crab. Yeah. Ooh. Archeana Vamira. <laughs> each player can't cast more than one spell each turn. Non basic lands your opponent controls enters the battlefield tapped. Then we got Cat Beast and an insect. Alright. We fixed the rare pile, so we make sure we never see that bastard again. And then we open the next pack away from the camera. We flip a flop. Uh, Zapping Duelist. Wow. Alright, I have a deck for you. I don't like the deck, but I know someone who does, and that's why I make it. This card isn't that good. It's just Soul Salvage, but more expensive. Risen Riptide. This thing isn't bad, but it doesn't support elementals. That's the main problem I have with Zendikar. <laughs> Fucking, it's not supporting the thing I loved about it. Uh, Marasa Brute. Oh yeah, it's a 3 tree. Utility Knife is busted for the fucking white-red warrior deck. Base Camp? Don't care for it. Zoff Consumption. Uh, loses four for six. It's not that good. Land. Myriad Construct. Four. Kick it for seven. If it's kicked, enters with one one counters on it for each non-basic land your opponent controls. This thing's only good in Commander. Like, that's just the truth. I I don't want to ruin anyone's feelings, but it's true. Kazai Royal Chaser. Fucking... This thing helps wizards. Because it makes it so... X costs less, where X is the number of wizards you control, as this ability resolves. Uh, why the fuck? Yo, just stay bright. Just fuck off for a minute. There we go. Alright. Skyclave GOP, which is 2-2. Two, two. That's not too bad. Be better if it. Oh uh, no! I guess that's what the fucking wall is for. Ooh! Oh, ho, ho, ho. It's Groot, baby. Plyeth, world sculptor. Whenever you enter the battlefield, create a zero-one plant creature token for each basic land you control. Never land into the battlefield. Put four one-one counters on target plant you control. So good. So sexy. I love them. And then we have this fucking squid. Ruining our vibes. Get out of here. And then another Nissa making it four. No, yep, this is my fourth one. And it's foil. Alternate art. I now have one of each. Fuck yes. Angel Warrior. And then a construct. What the myriad kills himself to become. So his children can become stronger. Ah, fuck it. I'll put that in. Pull this out. Alright. And then we flip. Deliberate. It's it's just Omen of the Sea, except not an enchantment. Cliffhaven Cell Sword. He still has a sword, so I don't believe he sold it. Hagra Constrictor. This thing's good in a 1 1 deck. Well, plus 1 plus 1 deck. Sizzling Barrage. I want. These boys, they're so cute. Give me the boys. I want them all. I want this one. Look at this one. He's so happy. He's so happy he gets to rip them apart. But I can't. I'm not happy. Because I can't rip people apart. Deadly Alliance. Hell yeah. Fucking murder spell. That can cost a shit ton less if you know what you're doing. Umara Mystic. Whenever you cast an instant of sorcery. Or well, a wizard spell gets plus two until end Wow, that's really fucking good. It's not even the first time, it's just when you cast it. Ah, yes. This boy, whenever he deals combat damage, 
Fucking target player mills a card. Oh, no, that player mills a card, not target. Stupid. We got forest. Ready for the prayers? Ooh, Tarzuri, beacon of unity. Fucking, this spell costs one less for each creature in your party. Pay four or eight. Look at the top six cards of your library. You may reveal up to two cleric, rogue, wizard, warrior, or an ally card from among them and put them in your hand. Put the rest at the bottom in a random order. This card works very well with its older print self. Fucking. It, it, it's just being cheesy. Ooh, Skyclave Shade. Uh, five. Two, kick if a five. Can't be blocked. Oh, can't block. If it's kicked, enters the battlefield with two one one counters on it. Whenever a land enters battlefield under your control, if Skyclave Shade enter, is in your graveyard, it's and it's your turn, you may cast it from your graveyard this turn. Kicker included. Hell yeah, I love this thing. Looks so cool. I fucking love them. Somebody fucking beat my ass with this thing. <laughs> I, I, I can't hold it to get... <laughs> Now I have a full set of Skyclave Shades. Thank you. Thank you, Jared. You have given me full sets of many things. A Canopy Biolith? We don't care. Needle Pathway for you. Oh my god. We got three more packs to open, everybody. We got an Illusion. We're gonna copy. Hell yeah. Alright. Last three. Let's go. We flip. Chilling Trap, target creature gets minus four until end turn. If you control a wizard, draw a card. Capriti Outrider. Whenever it enters the battlefield, target creature gets plus one, plus one until end turn. For each creature in your party. Gnarled Colony. This one isn't bad. Fucking kick it. Gives all creatures with plus one, plus one trample. Uh, it's just... It's a cheaper... At the start, but a more expensive and late game version of the fucking uh, cat from 21. I don't remember what it's called. Uh, but it has almost the same ability. Just can't be kicked. Uh, Makindi Ox. We already know what this boy is. Gracial Grasp. grasp bleh. Tap like a creature. Its controller mills two cards. That creature doesn't untap during its controller's next untap phase. Draw a card. God, I hate mill. I fucking hate mill. Uh, when Ravenger's Mace enters the battlefield, attach the target creature you control. Uh, gets equipped creature gets plus one plus zero for each creature in your party. So maximum's plus four. That's not too good, but it's not bad either. Little form blight, enchant land. When it enters the battlefield, draw a card. Enchanted land loses all types and abilities and has tap for colorless. And then tap and pay one life to add one mana of any color. It's not bad. It's mana fixing for black with anything else it needs. Mm. And we got Force. Now for the rare. Ooh. Timberton Synopsis. Fucking. We've all seen this. And there's another one right behind it. So I'll read the effect of the other one. But if you look kind of closely. I don't know if the camera will fix itself. So it doesn't look like a yes. But the roots kind of, Well, the base of the art looks like the body for this. But I love, I love this. I don't want to these boys and go. These aren't the lands I need. Ooh. Hell yeah. Uh, Dark Schlick Soars. It's just tap unless you have two, unless you control two or fewer lands. Not bad. You got an Angel Warrior with a Goblin Construct. And now, I got a sneeze I'm trying to fight back. It's not going back. And now I have the sensation of sneezing without sneezing. God damn it. Alright. This thing would be better if you could cast it at instant speed. Uh, Scorch Rider. If it's kicked, gains haste. That's not good. That's not good. That's 6 for a 4 3. That's stupid. That's so stupid. Mind drain. I hate you. Royal Eruption. Fucking. Kick it, make it a 7. Deals 3 for 2. Mm, that's not too bad, actually. It doesn't exile, but... It does a shit ton of damage. This thing is great for trying to make a fucking... Uh, bleh, party deck. 
without needing anything. I, I'm trying to make a deck with him. This boy will be good. Don't worry. He will be beautiful. Uh, kick him. You get to kick. Return a kicker card from your graveyard to your hand. What's this do? Uh, pay five. Look at the top X cards. Or X is three plus the number of creatures in your party. Put three of those cards in your hand and the rest of the bottom of your library in random order. That's not too bad. We got plums. Oh my god, yes. Tabrix. Hope's demise. Uh, he has lifelink as long as he has five or more counters on him. Whenever another non-token creature you control dies, put a 1-1 counter on him. If it was a cleric, you may draw a card. If you do, lose one life. So good. Oh yeah. Card get intimidated. Fucking cowards can't block warriors. Choose one that has been chosen this turn. He's not a legendary, so if you are four of these, it's kind of fucked. I'm fucking, I'm put, yeah, it's one of these for each one of these boys. So you can choose all three of them for each one. And it's just good. It's just so good. Alright. We've seen a hundred of these and a hundred more of those. Ooh. Bulk Knot Exploration. Never land in the battlefield under your control. Exile the top card of your library. You may play this card as long as it remains exiled. At the beginning of your end step, if there are any cards exiled, with Volknut Exploration, put them into the owner's graveyard, then Volknut Exploration deals that much damage to each opponent. Oof! That works so well with Nahiri's Lithomancing. Dreadworm, we don't care. Roiling Vortex, ooh, beautiful. And you got a Drake, an Insect, alright. This is the last pack, everyone. We're gonna put all of the luck, every last bit of GG in to this pack. And with this pack, we will not only pull two mythics, we will also pull three rares. I can guarantee this. <laughs> Watch. It's gonna happen. Alright? I can guarantee to every single one of you who is going to be watching this video that this last pack is going to be amazing. We flip. Inco inordinate Rage. Plus three, plus two until end turn. And scry one. That's actually really fucking good. Marauding Blight Priest. Also good. Uh, Malakar Blood Priest. Uh, whenever he enters the battlefield, each opponent loses X life, where X is the number of creatures. Oh, and you gain X life, where X is the number of creatures on your party. <clears throat> Goddamn. Disenchant. Destroy target artifact or enchantment. Yeah. Shepherd of the Heroes. Shepherd of the Heroes enters the battlefield, you gain two life for each creature in your party. Uh, there was a card similar to this that was released in 21. Except instead of creatures in your party, you gain two health points, each creature you control with flying. And it's a uh, five drop, two, I do believe. Thundering Rebuke. This is stupid good. Why is this so good? Tap, pay two, deal four damage to target creature or planeswalker. That's so goddamn good. Umaru Wizard, pay 5. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery, gains flying until end turn. That's not really that good. Mountain, Master of the Winds. Uh, enter this, draw 2 cards, and discard a card. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery, you may have it switch its base toughness and power to become either 4 1 or 1 4. Not really that good. Nice. I'm gonna make something abysmal with this deck. Everyone will hate it. I can guarantee. So it's two rares. <laughs> We're gonna get there, boys. We're gonna get that third rare. We got a scoot swarm, my boys. <laughs> Hell yeah. Fucking whenever land enters the battlefield, you're a control creator. One one green insect c creature token. If you control six or more lands, create a copy. Create token that's a copy of scoot swarm. Scoot scoot. Territorial sky cat. Charix, the Raging Isle. Yeah, I do fucking look at this. Look at this mythic rare boy. So beautiful. And we got a creature card. Alright. I hope y'all enjoyed. I'll catch y'all in a bit. Bye.